What is going on, everybody? It's Titanic Feed Jack, and I'm back at you again with another video. I'd like to welcome you guys back to the channel if you want to continue to follow me along as I build this sneaker collection. There's a list of my socials down below. Also, I ask that you follow me here on YouTube and sub up to the channel so you'll be notified every time I drop a video here on this channel. And also, you can interact with me in the Family Vibes Discord group. Here's the IG page right there. Message the Instagram account if you'd like to join or you can hit myself up if you have any questions about joining Discord group and we'll get you started on your journey to build your sneaker collection for retail or a little more than retail now today i got an early review for you guys uh just gonna jump right into it because it represents the city where i'm at again we see that jordan one nike box black box red lettering and you see that box tag i'm gonna read it out loud for you guys you see it's air jordan one retro low og z the color of the is flex, muslin, fauna, and brown, size 12. And not sure what these are going to retail at. Pop the top. See that lot stamp right there inside the box top. You got that white paper. And look inside. You got the YDM sticker. Make sure your pants have all that good information. If you decide to purchase on the secondary market, here we go, guys. We have the Air Jordan Retro One Low Zion Williamson, star player of the New Orleans Pelicans. This sneaker is a lot of different materials on it. We're gonna jump right into it. Looking at your quarter panel, we got some tan suede going on there, nice grain, kind of thick, and you have some canvas material going on here. And on the heel in the uh, dark tan colorway, we have a chocolate brown Nike swoosh, which is a short gram of suede, not that thick. And you have a little gray going on right here on the lace eyelets. Lace eyelets. Looking at the midsole of the sneaker, you have a cereal color midsole with a tan uh, at the very bottom, and it leads to the outsole. And I say tan, I meant to say gum. You have a gum color outsole. There you go. And if you look at the right on the heel, we have a voodoo pin. You know that is uh, very popular in New Orleans if you practice voodoo. Looking at the heel of the sneaker, you have the Wings logo upside down. And if you peel it up, they got some writing on here and it says Zion, which is Zion Williamson. And you look on the medial side, you have this right here. This may or may not be Zion's signature in the threading right there. And you have more of that nice tan suede on the medial side of the sneaker with the chocolate swoosh. That is suede as well. You got that great canvas going on here on your lace eyes, let's and more of that darker tan right here that matches the uh, tan on the heel. Sail midsole. Um, uh, at the very bottom then looking at your toe cap your toe box you have some uh, green uh, canvas material and you have a chocolate brown Nike swoosh and brought it on and looking at the toe box the toe box is a little different than you would normally see on your jaw one lows look like they got a bunch of crosses stitched on here which represents voodoo as well and you have rope laces and it does come with additional laces. The laces are affixed to the other shoe. There you go. And you got a darker tan suede on here and a woven patch that's upside down right there with the Nike Air on there. And you have a gray looking sock liner. And you have your cardboard shoe tree, size 12. 12 and a half and looking at the insert there you go get a look at that size tag size 12 production date April 27th through June 21st but this is the sneaker the Zion Williamson show you the other shoe because I think it's a little something different under here on this one 
no one believe it, both say, yeah, this one says Voodoo, the other one says Zion. So let me know what y'all think of this sneaker, the Zion one, George Low. I like them a lot, I'm gonna try to get them in my size, so leave that in the comment section. And like I always tell you guys, if you can help somebody get a sneaker, help them get that sneaker, because you never know when it will be your turn needing a sneaker. I'm Titanic Feet Jack, signing out.